Well, that sound means it's time to verify. It is Weather Wednesday, and we're talking about water spouts. You've seen them on the South Carolina coast this summer. This just recently at the Isle of Palms. They tweeted out this video of a water spout near 3rd Avenue. You can see beachgoers observing it as the sky turned black and the funnel cloud descended to sea. So, Eric, this was one of several on the South Carolina coast on Saturday, prompting the National Weather Service in Charleston to issue a special marine warning. Water spouts, as we said, are either fair weather or tornadic. And the tornadic ones can be pretty severe. So, Eric, my question is this. Can water spouts come ashore as tornadoes? Hmm. So the answer is that yes, that's possible, but it's very rare, uh, very mm -hmm. rare for this to happen. So basically, with if we break down the two different types of water spouts, the ones that we normally see are fair weather, which yeah. are fairly weak, and we've got some graphics that we want to show okay. you real quick. Uh, if we look at the tornadic ones, now those are technically, they're actual tornadoes that just oh. develop over the water, and very rarely do you see a, a thunderstorm that strong to do a tornado over the water. It can help them, uh, or it can happen though, but they come from thunderstorms. Storms. They cause high winds and high seas, large hail, frequent lightning, just like around a tornado. And they can move technically from even land to water or backwards water to land. Now, if you look at a fair weather water spout, they're much smaller. This is more likely what we would see in our neck of the woods. They come from just a developing cumulus cloud bank, not a thunderstorm cell. Uh, light winds, not very strong. They don't move very much. They kind of stay where they are. If they do move ashore, they usually break apart when it starts to interact with the friction on, on the ground. So very yeah. rarely do we see a fair weather system. Now, I and I've actually seen several of those uh, in my life and when they move ashore they'll just spray a little bit of water and yeah. sand into the air and they're gone. So that one at Isle of Palms behind you looks kind of like a tornadic one because the sky is dark. Would you say that that's it's the case or not hard, necessarily? Hard to tell. Mm -hmm. I can say just by looking at the graphic of that that it's small enough that I think it's more of a fair weather yeah. situation. It would have to be a massive big wide thunderstorm anvil cloud set up for that to happen. But would it weaken as it goes to shore or back to sea vice versa? The the fair weather ones can't mm -hmm. hardly can make it on right. shore but a tornadic one should weaken a little bit once mm -hmm. it gets over land because the friction is less over water okay. than it is over land. So land tends to disrupt the flow a little bit. All right, interesting. Thanks, Eric, yep. for verifying. If you have an inquiry, remember we do weather questions every Wednesday. Submit a selfie video of your question, email it to me, post it on my Facebook page, or tweet it. Let me get your questions verified.